I'm Tinsy Tarantula, and these are my spiders. Hey buddy, welcome back to the channel, and a another spider shop unboxing. This is a unsexed juvenile species, um, the Haplobulbus SP Gorilla, the Fire Red Pumpkin, or the Red Pumpkin Patch. Um, this is the first time I've seen a spider shop have these, so I thought I'd get one. Unsexed juvenile, um, quite, quite rare, and obviously classed as the biggest Haplobulbus species so if we flip the camera around unbox it and see what size it is before we decide which enclosure to use so the box is open and let's see what we've got so we've got find your next jumper a leaflet regal jumping spiders a cool leaflet of jumping spiders i've never actually got a jumping spider so it could be potentially something that i get in the future but a cool Jumping spider leaflet. And obviously the jumping spider starter kits, purpose built, terrariums, drop down door, lid, it roof and nest inspires, removable top cover, easy to construct. And it's um, you've got macro plants, spider nest hide, a boreal feeding ledge, decor substrate, and spray bottle. So I could potentially get a re a jumping spider starter kit. And potentially get a jumping spider even so let me know would that be cool if you want to see a jumping spider in the collection at some point in the future heat pack heat packs nice and warm as usual obviously the weather in here in the united kingdom is gone from summer uh we're currently in november so we're getting towards that cold weather time and yep heat packs are lovely and warm Nice and hot, as always. Your chippies, your polystyrene chips. So what we got in here? Oh, that's the spider. HP Gorilla. What else have we got in here? I think this is food. Yep, big tub of Mario worms for upcoming feeding video. Nothing else in here, nope. Just checking. Sometimes you get freebies, sometimes you don't with a spider shop. It just depends if they're feeling generous. But like I said, quite a lot of my spiders come from the spider shop and no deaths on arrival. So we'll open the lid, have a quick look. Just so we can see what size the spider is. So we can decide, determine what enclosure to use. <clears throat> so we have a look. It's webbed up already. Oh, it's a small, it's small, so we might have to use one of, yeah. It's not fully grown yet. <clears throat> yeah, it's not quite fully grown yet, so it'll have to be one of, but look at it. So it'll be one of these for now. One of these empty cricket keepers, because like I said, it's not fully grown yet, so no point sticking it in a massive Enclosure, so we'll prepare it. We'll use one of these, bit of mud, cork bark hide, and a little water dish. No point putting it any, in anything bigger because it's not fully grown yet. Obviously it will get quite big, but it's still small juvenile. So it's got a long way to go, so there's no point putting it in anything bigger until it's fully grown. But look at that, ain't that stunning? So... There you have it. Enclosure, little bottle cup of water, 
soil, little cork bark, and like I said, that'll be it till the spidey fully grows. So let's gently put the spider down. Look, hopefully, it turns out to be a female, that'd be awesome. It's obviously it's not fully grown yet, but it's there. We go gently. Does it look? Look at that. Go on, little one. Go on, then. It's okay. There you go. Bit of hair kicking already. That's cool. And there you go. Look at that. <laughs> oh, we get back down. Oi, where are you going? I know you're trying to explore your new enclosure, but get back down. There you go. There you go. <clears throat> awesome stuff. We'll try and get a zoom shot so you can see it. There it is. If so you can see it. There it is, brand new Haplobulbus SP Gorilla, the Fire Red Pumpkin, um, Unsex Juvenile, not fully grown yet, um, it is the biggest Haplobulba species, hopefully it turns out to be female, but there you go, awesome stuff, can't wait to see this one fully grow and see its adult coloration. Pretty simple unboxing, didn't give me no problems. And another spider to the collection, like I said, obviously it's small at the moment, but once fully grown, it will get rehoused into something bigger, because it is the biggest Haplobulba species. And um, the first time the spider shop, I've seen a spider shop have these in stock, so I thought I'd get one. And I went back on there the other day to have a look, and they've sold out of them now, so I'm glad I got one got the order in when I did otherwise I'd have missed it but there you go Haplobarbus SP Gorilla the fire red pumpkin great unboxing from the spider shop as I said the pack always warm great packaging and as you can see great spider lively awesome stuff and what can you ask another new spider to the collection and a pretty cool one as well The saltwater aquarium is doing well, all the animals are doing well, and this is the most fun I have um, when I'm adding stuff to the saltwater tank or buying new tarantulas. I've been making videos for over three years now, over 500 videos, and the channel is really growing well. So I want to thank each and everybody. Um, and hopefully the channel gets bigger. It'd be awesome if you could drop a like, leave a comment and subscribe so we can really grow the channel. And like I said, a massive thank you to all the OGs and all the new subscribers. It is the most fun I have filming all the animal videos. Don't forget to rate, subscribe, comment and bye for now.